Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. So, a little bit ago I talked about the eight stages of psychosocial development. Um, <clears throat> today, I, I was very vague about it, but today I'm going to be a little bit more detailed and try to show at least a little bit more relation in the first stage. Um, I'm going to split this up into eight different videos uh, talking about each individual stage and just talking about like how to relate it um, a little bit more detail on my knowledge on that kind of thing and my kind of experiences on that front I'm going to be vague for the sake of you know protecting individual identities and stuff like that if that makes sense um, but with that said let's go ahead and get into the first trust versus mistrust now, the idea behind this, for those who don't know, is kind of the, it's the factor of when you're a baby uh, and a parent or guardian is taking care of you, depending on how it go, they go about this, how well they do it and how much attention they actually get or focus they put into actually taking care of the child, um, leads to an outcome of whether the mindset of this uh at the time baby but to be infant child adult you know yada 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 it, it leads to where, whether their mindset tells them to actually trust individual like people in general or not this doesn't apply to everyone but that was kind of the original concept of it um nowadays you can kind of tell that this doesn't just apply to like uh, that specific thing sure uh subconsciously it always has applied in that sense but there are a lot of things out in the real world where trust versus mistrust becomes a very big deal based off specific aspects a uh, good example for me would be past relationships that i've had one of the aspects that always seems to come first for me is that um whether or not I should trust the individual is based off kind of how their actions towards me are within the first, you know, few weeks that I know them. Now, from there, it can go into friendships or enemies or acquaintances, you know, whatever it might be. But Pink Fox is actually another good example of this, uh, being that obviously a lot of trust towards this one. <laughs> I put it back together after some person broke it. Just... <laughs> I put it, I put not, nostalgic Dave back together. That's that's a story that you guys probably could just look up on the channel itself. Not going to get too deep into that, but that actually is a very good example of what I'm talking about of the mistrust side of things. Um, I'm the trust. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, so with that being said, I think that over time, a lot of the aspects that could be taken into this. Um, like, let's, let's rewind to where it originally, uh, was pointing towards, which, again, is the whole whether parents actually focus on taking care of the baby at the time or not, leading to either mistrust or trust, as a whole to just reality. A good example of this would be, well, a lot of the time, you'll, a baby, a lot of babies do this, not every one of them, but a lot of them, you know, find, they find, you find them crying, like, in their crib or something, sometime in the middle of the night i guarantee there are several people out there who will just like be laying in bed and go they're fine some of them cry but sometimes that isn't a good thing to do sometimes just being there do being it for yeah them helps them it shows that you care that you're willing to do anything for the baby which means yeah which basically helps them trust you it kind of leads to the like the ignorance. Type of dork. Well, not just to me, to several individuals. And his sister, and his brother. Yeah. Good kids. Either way, um, that that kind of is a very prime example of what that particular stage is talking about. Um, if the if the guardians, parents, whatever they might be, just completely ignore it. First of all. Child services would be there to take him away pretty quickly if they ever found out anyway. <laughs> um, but second of all, that would directly impact over time whether 
the child can trust anyone or not. And quite frankly, per, in personal opinion, it's kind of sad to me when uh, they're just not given any attention at all. And it, when it comes to needs, when it comes to desires, that usually doesn't come till later on, but that one's a bit more reasonable. I mean, you, limited maybe on desires, but just to not pay any heed is ridiculous. But yeah, that I find it interesting how much that actually does impact that particular stage. Anyway, kind of going on a loop on this one, but these are kind of mine and I guess now Pink Fox's thoughts on the first stage of psychosocial development. Uh, next time we talk about this, I'll go ahead and get to the second stage. Whether Amber's here or not, we'll see. Anyway, thanks for tuning into this uh, little episode. Um, if you like this video, make sure to push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. Uh, if you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Got any suggestions for any type of theories, uh, psychological theories you'd like me to talk about or any of us to talk about for that matter? Honestly, me, Amber, and Aaron, we've all studied psychology and sociology to a degree. So if you want to hear any of our opinions on that kind of thing, let us know in the comments below. Um, want to check out any other, uh, any other topics uh, or any of the other stages, I guess I should say. Click the link over here. Maybe it might at first just give you a random topic or a random video. So if it does that probably haven't gotten to it yet but if it does give you the actual playlist there you go um want to check out anything that might suit your fitting though click the link on the other side where youtube will give you an idea of what you might enjoy on this channel if neither are right quite floating your boat why not click the link that's right underneath my face or just down there somewhere uh and you, why not check out the channel for yourself in the meantime we're gonna have thanks again for tuning in this video everyone hope to see you guys in another see you guys later